Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 4. This is chapter 5, tech 5, the final chapter of the game. And we have to take on Sadler and escape this island and bring home Ashley safe and sound. This is the gaming casual, if I haven't said that already, and let's see what the snow has to say. Our mission. The real power of the United States lies in three areas. The Justice Department, the administrative bodies, and the military. In order to take control of these areas, we must influence the minds of the people who advise the president. After this is done, the rest of the departments will quickly fall under our sway. If by chance the United States were to figure out our plan, the damage caused should be minimal. We will still be able to conquer the country as planned using our backup plan. Once we control the country, we will use their international influence to our advantage. The rest of the world will fall swiftly. As already stated, if our first plan doesn't go as smoothly as expected, we'll proceed with our secondary plan. By sending in our special forces, we will infiltrate the country from within. Fear and chaos will spread through the nation like a virus. It's only a matter of time before the country loses its stability. At that time, when they are most vulnerable, we will strike. Rejoice, my brethren. Brethren, we were, the world shall soon be cleansed. It's kind of creepy to know that this game was made in 2005 and what they just described kind of mirrors what's happening in America today. I don't know if that's a coincidence or a conspiracy theory, but it is odd. I'm just going to point that out for sure. All right. So the next thing we're going to do is be taking on Sadler. So I want to load up all my weapons, make sure we're locked and loaded. Sell Welcome. off anything I need to sell off and upgrade my last things I need to upgrade. What are you selling? Don't really know. Don't really need this. So let's ah. get rid of it. <laughs> Thank you. I need all the health items I can carry. What are you buying? I want to upgrade my killer seven, I think. I can only really choose that. Yeah, upgrade my fire. So let's, let's do the capacity. <laughs> that makes you. sense. And I think that's it. Really, I can't really do anything with that. Come back so, I guess we're as ready as we'll ever be. Well, let's go. Something's not right. Ashley, you stay here. Ada! Better try a new trick, cause that one's getting old. Uh. Uh. You okay? I've been better. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, I think you know. The American prevailing is a cliché that only happens in your Hollywood movies. Oh, Mr. Kennedy, you entertain me. To show my appreciation, I will help you awaken from your world of clichés. Ada, stand back. That is some nasty stuff right there. Let's see if I can utilize my grenades. Might as well use what I have available to me. There we go. Have to shoot him in the eye. I don't know why he leaves it vulnerable, but he does. Oh, I only got one shot on him. That sucks. Let's try this again though. No, we're not going to fall this time. 
Oh, you did, actually. <laughs> okay. Didn't want to use that. Incendiary grenade, maybe. Let's move this way. Uh-oh, I think he's gonna throw something at me. Come at me, bro. No. Darn it. You know, I might as well use it. You, you're supposed to shoot the eyes on his uh, legs. Ow. Shit. Let's not die. Let's, uh... Use that real quick. Oh, he's fast. So, let's go this way. I don't know if he could turn, turn himself back into normal Saddler after basically destroying his body. I don't know the regenerative pop properties of their bodies. Come on over here. Is that gonna cause him to stun? Oh, it did. I don't know if I'll be able to hit and reach him with the Killer 7 map. I'm actually kind of thinking about using the... No, dang it. I should have used my sniper. Figures. If he gets close enough, you can use the, utilize this little crane and we'll <laughs> knock him down. I don't know if that does anything. I had to hit his, uh, the eyes on his um, legs, but sometimes if you just do enough damage to an enemy, it, it has an effect. Where's your eye? Take that. Oh, shoot. Uh oh, he's gonna be right there. I get up. You were waiting for me, weren't you? You knew what you wanted. Does he charge? He does. I wanna get up here. Use this thing again. Operate it. Excuse me. Alright. Bam. No? Nothing? Dang it. I was hoping that would be enough. Maybe if my uh, gun was a little bit more upgraded for damage. Well, let's shoot at him with this thing. Come on. Reveal your eyes to me. Should do it. I mean, this is the most st the strongest gonna have. Use this. Oh, thank you, Ada. That helps a lot. Now I just need to find room for it. Well, use that, and just move everything out of the way. Ah. Okay. Looks good to me. All right. I only have one shot with this thing, so I better make it count. Oh! You jerk. Don't know what would happen if you missed. Sorry, Leon. Hand it over. Ada, you do know what this is. Hmm. Island too. She really pushed it. 
Here, catch. Better get a move on. See you around. Very cute. Timer's still going, Leon, and you're wasting time. Come on. All right. This final part can be kind of tricky, so hopefully I don't mess it up too much. I when I practice this um, this section, I uh, had kind of a difficult time getting through it. We have to get off this island now. It's gonna blow any minute. It's gonna what? It's gonna blow up, Ashley. You gotta run. Move like you never moved before. Gotta remember to catch her though. Of course she won't jump down like I do. That's a lot of weight to catch. Nice that could, makes me feel it in my back. Okay. Use the jet sneak key. I don't really know how not to like die in this exactly other than to dodge the um, things that you'll crash into but there's a part <clears throat> where the rocks fall and I keep dying at that spot Accelerating and everything is like these rocks here. It can be issues sometimes. I don't know if it's because I'm not far enough away from them when they land or what. Like right there, I don't. I turned. Oops, sorry, I had to move my chair. This is gonna be difficult. If I make too many errors, I'm definitely gonna have to edit out all the mistakes. Hang on, sweetheart. So I'll give myself three good tries doing this, and then if I keep failing, because I really don't know. I thought I'd turned far enough, but I guess not. And it's, it seems just to be that one that's giving me issues, too. Okay. Guess I don't really need to be quiet through the cutscenes. So it's going to be one on the left. Or move to the left. Then to the right. So maybe... What the heck? What happened? What? I don't even know what caught... It must have been the waves that are catching up to me. I'm accelerating. I don't... I'm not quite understanding what's going on. Hang on, sweetheart. Oh. Because uh, I'm pushing forward on the stick. I don't know. It's going to be a turkey to me, I guess. Come on. Okay. If I fail this time, I'm going to edit. Because we're almost done with this game. What's going on in front of me? I gotta pay attention to what's going on in front of me because clearly it's important. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, I'll be back. <laughs> I was not paying attention. Uh, I looked over for a second. All right. Finally got around that. Oh, 
Come on. Let's go home. <laughs> Sounds like a great idea. Mission accomplished. Right, Leon? Not quite. I still have to get you home safe. So, uh, after you take me back to my place, how about we do some, um, overtime? <laughs> Sorry. Somehow I knew you'd say that, but it doesn't hurt to ask, you know? So, who was that woman, anyway? Why do you ask? Come on, tell me. She's like a part of me I can't let go. Let's leave it at that. All right, well, that will be the end of this Resident Evil 4 Let's Play, at least on the normal mode. I don't know when I'll be back to do the professional mode, but um, you can look forward to me doing that eventually. I also have, I guess there's like two other modes on here, like Project Ada and I forget the other one, but... Um, I might do those. I've never done those before. They weren't on the original GameCube, so it would be my first time playing through those, so I kind of want to see what's up with that. And I guess there's new outfits and stuff you can unlock. Looks like the background is telling a tale of the villagers. Put my controller down here. This is a great game. I had fun replaying it here on the Switch. I would highly recommend anyone who hasn't given it a shot to give it a look look at. Ooh, the music's changing. Something sinister. Ah, it looks like it's depicting all the uh, experiments and things that were going on. The Los Illuminatas, giving people the plagas. Ooh, it looks like a child in that seat. That's not... That's not right. I guess there weren't any kids in the village that you saw. They are remaking this game, so... I'm hoping that when that comes out, I'll have the, the ability to play it and do a, a playthrough of that. But um, you can stick around and watch the credits if you'd like. I'm just going to watch them with you and comment, do some commentary. After you beat the game, you unlock a second playthrough. You can keep all your gear and you unlock new weapons that you can buy that are like and the infinite rocket launcher. And if you do the other game modes, like the Mercenaries, I think you can unlock like a hand cannon or something like that. Chicago typewriter. At least those were the guns that you can unlock back in the GameCube days. But the Mercenaries um, mode game, that mini game is actually kind of difficult. Because if I remember, you need to get five stars with every character on all the levels. But you can play as a... Uh, Ada, Leon, Krauser, and this guy named Hunk or Hank. I think. I don't think you can play as Lewis. Unless they've added Lewis as a character. And maybe Wesker, too. I'm actually kind of interested to see if they added any new characters to play in the Mercenaries. All you're trying to do is, like, kill as many people as you can and get accumulate points by killing him in succession. Characters and events depicted in this game are fictitious and similarities to actual persons living or dead is purely coincidental. The game is protected under the laws of Raccoon City to police department. Okay. Hunnigan, is that you? Finally, the line's jack free. Hey Hunnigan, no glasses. Forget the glasses. What's the status of the mission? I've rescued the subject. We're returning home. You did it, Leon. Thanks. You know, you're kind of cute without those glasses. 
Give me your number when I get back. May I remind you that you're still on duty. Story of my life. Wow. You're gonna sexual harassment, Leon. You better be careful. This is not quite the environment you want to be trying to hit on your colleagues. Let's see how I did overall. Killed number of times killed eleven times. That's not too bad. 83% hit ratios. I could probably bump that up. 925 enemies killed. I wonder out of how many possible it took me 11 hours. Awesome. I guess I'll update the leaderboards. Not that I'm going to be... Now you can buy an infinite launcher and a Matilda from the merchant. Sweet. And, uh... I already kind of beat this game when I was practicing, but I'll save over again. All right, well, let's take a look at these uh, other things we got. So, extras. We got separate ways. I don't know what that's about. I'll give that a shot. Assignment Ada, the mercenaries, and then the movie browser. You can see all the movies. I actually want to see. So it looks like you unlock them as you go. Pretty sure this is obviously this is Leon, Ada, Krauser, Hunk, I think his name is, and Wesker. Alright, well, this has been the Gaming Casual. If you liked the episode, press the like button if you have something to say, leave a comment, and I'll see you around.